Crown Rising family, I have a poem to share with you today. I actually wrote this about four years ago, but it seems it would be fitting for this time. It's called Don't Feed the Fears. This is the end. The world as we know it is over. But is it over if we are all living in our own dream? These days, they're giving out cages for our hearts to keep us apart. Because if we were one, how could we lose? You see, Society seeks to separate us, pulls us down and degrades us, molds us and shapes us so that we do not love each other. Because if we did, we would rise up. We would rage against the dying of the light. But we don't. Because we never listen to Mama. We never listened to Mama when she said, don't feed the fears. Don't you, child, give them your tears. We never listened to Mama because us humans, we crave the drama. We see the wreckage on the side of the road and we take a picture. Take a picture, the pain will last longer. And we go on to the next place as if one less person to occupy space and I'd hate it when I was told, don't be so sensitive. If you feel too much, try not to be so in touch with your emotions. And I'd say, but I cry oceans. And how can't I? How can't I? What do you want me to do? Roll over and die? You want me to lie about the pain that runs through my veins? Well, my love, is holy and by that i mean i love holy i don't go where i'm told i'm led by intuition i go by the beat of my own heart my soul tribe that i won't hide so i'll swallow my pride because these days life will take your hopes and your dreams and seemingly dash it to the now I'll twirl till the world gives me spins. I'll look up at the sky till I no longer wonder why God made me so sensitive. So you could remind them, she said, don't feed the fears. Thank you for tuning in. I'm wishing you well in health, prosperity, and abundance. May we all rise together. I see you. I appreciate you.